Good morning, my fellow artists. How are you today? It is Sunday. I think it's around the 4th. It might be the 5th. Time change this morning was lovely. I completely appreciated that. Uh, I know people don't like to have the time change. I, I would probably rather not have it, but it was nice to have that little extra bit of sleep and not have the morning completely wasted by sleeping. Uh, anyway, gorgeous day outside. I'm going to be going to the movie today. I'm going to go see Queen in IMAX. Can't wait. That'll be awesome. Um, I have a show coming up on Friday at work. That's all jewelry and some of my art. I'll definitely take some of my artwork with me. Um, so I need to work on some notebooks and uh, different things like that. But I actually have an idea for this book and this is of course my frame book and I will do four and six here um, for you soon. But I had this idea today, and so I kind of need to really work on it. So I glued all of these pages to the front of the book individually. I like having the strength that gluing individually gives us. It also did great things to strengthen up that spine there. I will be putting in um, tape on each entrance here. I don't want to do it on these center ones. Okay, so I've got all of this. This is probably, well, it's eight pages plus all the intro pages, so I'd say it's 12 pages or so. Um, and then, of course, this is two pages glued together, two pages glued together, and this is actually three pages glued together. And then we start out with these guys. This here um, kind of triggered me to a book that I've been wanting to do, and that is the circus book. And um, I have a bunch of images that I have um, gotten off the internet for the last, oh, I, I did those long, long ago, almost a year ago. And I did do one, um, I did do one canvas that had, um, this is my circus, these are my monkeys on it. So uh, what I'm doing here is I love these illustrations here and uh, so I woke up with this idea for my circus book and you guys are going to go along with me on construction. I, I don't know. Honestly, I don't know how this is going to work out and uh, this is just kind of my starting off point here. We'll see what happens. Um, okay, so basically this is uh, it could be four double pages, right? Four doubles. And you all know what I mean when I do that. I, I have glued two pages together, right? I'm not going to keep saying that. I'm just going to call them doubles. If you don't understand what doubles, then just ask later, right? Okay. So you'll see what I'm going to do with that later, right? So this is essentially my first page of the book, right? Okay. So I'm going to give you a hint. I found these at the dollar store, right? And look at this beautiful paper. All right. <laughs> I don't know if I can do this. I'll figure it out because this is a great idea, right? I think it's a great idea. I don't know if you do. These will all mostly get covered. I might leave these few images here. I, you know, the images are wonderful in here, but this really isn't very appropriate, right? Okay. These are not glued together. Should I just use cardstock? Let me look at the, let me look at cardstock here real quick. Let me see if I can find something that has a feel to it that is a bit caravan, a bit circus, circus gypsies, entertainers. Um, 
the uh that's kind of cool hold on uh, i don't know if this is even necessary to pick out something like this that's pretty paper it's gorgeous it's gorgeous i tell you i don't like sparkles i did not buy it for the sparkly pages in fact i wonder if i could use those to cover up those are so cool no, that basically is going to go in the garbage. Ugh. Do not put red glitter, pink glitter on anything of mine, please. Oh, there's blue glitter. Oh my god, that's so obnoxious. So, can I use the inside of this? I think I could. Um, let's, let's get rid of this nasty, nasty crap out of this beautiful set of paper. Oh, come on. And uh, it's entirely possible it's going to get covered with um, the stripes anyways. Not sure. Not sure. Um, although some of these would have absolutely worked too. I've been collecting some paper. Uh, I've been picking it up when I go into Joanne's or uh, God, Tuesday morning yesterday. Oh, you should see the haul. It's gross. So we're going to want it a little bit smaller. Actually, this does kind of a circus feel to it, doesn't it? Okay, let me get swoopy. We're going five by eight. Swoopy! Come here, my friend. My swoopers. Okay, so we've got 12, so we want to go to 7. All right. That's cutting through three pages. And I'm just going to do a couple more because I'm right here. Uh, let's leave that. Let's cut off some of that glitter. God. Actually, that ornateness is actually kind of cool. Hold on. Isn't it funny how as you're working with something, you're like, oh my god, and then you're like, oh, wait a second. That might be just right, actually. Okay, five by eight. So I'm going to cut it just a touch under that. Under, not over. And let's find out where the lettering is. Uh, let's keep it down at the bottom. Okay, five by eight. Five by eight. Go here. And this is five. That's five. Is this five? That's five. Okay. And then we've got some other um, frills. That part's kind of pretty. Let's take off the glitter. <laughs> I've become a true uh, fanatic, right? Oh, those are perfect sizes. I can do something with those, right? Oh, I'll stick that in my stash. That's a good size. My paper scrap stash is huge. I'm getting there. Okay. All right. Let's bring this back in. Now, remember, these are going to be covered. Those do kind of go together like that, don't they? I think they do. You see what I'm making yet? <laughs> you see it? Oh my God, what am I doing? I'm making another cityscape. <laughs> This was in my brain this morning when I woke up. I'm like, oh, 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 God, I gotta do it, I gotta do it, I gotta do it. Where's my athletic tape? It was seriously right here. Oh, would somebody please find me a professional organizer to come in? I seriously, I would pay him, well, not too much, but I'd pay out, you know, at least a hundred bucks to get everything organized here. Of course, it would take longer than that, but. Tape, athletic tape, okay, here we go. I believe I got this at the dollar store for a buck. You know, you don't have to pay a ton for it. Just, just go get it. 
Okay, so the tent topper. Okay, hold on. Uh, where's my circus images? Is this my file of circus? This is not my file of circus. What is this last thing back here, though? Oh, that's uh, more period pieces. Oh, God. <laughs> I think this is strange people. I think this is strange people. I will be going through this uh, for my... Look oh, yeah, how cool this one is. Jeez. You know it, right? This is not my circus people file. This is my strange people file. Okay. Let's uh, pull out and see if I can't find my circus images. That's couples. That's women. That's men. This one must be children. Where's my circus images one? Why isn't it here? You're flipping kidding me. Couples. Criminals. Oh, but I think she's one of my circus people. Let me see. We've got, oh, yeah, 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 here we are. Circus. Yay. All right, I know I have pictures of the big top in here. Tattooed lady. I love this one. See, look at these images. I mean, how can I not do circus? Right? Uh, this is also groups of people, it looks like. Oh, I've got some steampunk in here. So I can throw that in here, too. I do know for a fact. Fortune teller. <laughs> Ringleader. He's got to be on the first page, right? Yes, he does. We'll look for a couple of ringleaders. Uh, so there he's a little bit smaller again. I like the bigger one, though. Can you see it? Can you see what I'm doing in my brain? Oh, it's horrible. Some of these images, you know, they were just so cruel to, to animals. This was kind of cool, though. Um, all right, hold on. Here was a picture of the big tent. And here's another ringleader guy. Skinny guy. <laughs> Woman with a hippopotamus. I'm sure that was huge to see. And then here's all my criminals. I wanted to do a criminal book too. These guys are so suave. I mean, like this guy right here. <laughs> all right. Let's see. I thought I had more pictures of the big top. I swear to God, I did. The strong man, the strong woman. Um, yeah. Hit that image. Uh, I will be putting some of these on the front of this uh, okay. all right so I don't have a really great image of this okay so I'm just gonna have to construct it I always love the horses they were always my favorite part when I went to the circus you know, I'm not glorifying circuses and the treatment of animals and all that stuff, you know. But I think the imagery is incredible. So, I hope this doesn't cause issues. I think this will end up all getting covered anyway. So will it cause issues when I put paper over the top of it? That is the question. Okay. All right, let's start where we need to start. Let's 
see, I don't think I want those to open that direction. I think I want them to open this way. Oh, I need a crappy scissors. This is one I picked up at um, Staples, I think. It was on their dollar clearance. I have been watching out for uh, cheap scissors because I just tear through them so quickly. Okay, so let's repair this. Strengthen this. It's not a repair yet. This is a strengthener, right? I like using athletic tape. Uh, for one, it's, it takes the color really well. You can paint over it. You can do anything over it that you want to. Um, okay. 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 Um... page. Front of the tent. Exacto. This is going to be thick. This is going to be super thick. I'm not lying. Lion. Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my. All right, so I want that to be able to close all the way there. So I'm gonna take it from, I'm gonna glue it or tape it while it's still together, right? And that way I'm making sure that it'll close all the way, right? I can't do the Galileos. Uh oh. All right, so this page is glued down. So, got a little construction issue here, but we can make it work. Uh, as we know, we'll cover the front anyway. So, truly, not a big deal, right? Just put tape down over the top of that. Okay. And I'm going to, uh, all right, I'm going to see how this fits closed. I'm going to tape it to the outside of the book. As you know, my cover will be totally redone. Uh, so we're just going to tape it. It's all right. Uh, we've got double strength on there, which I love. Okay. There we go. There will be another page that's going to be glued on here. Okay, so let's uh, pop this guy free. Get down in here into that seam. Try not to cut too deep because we don't want to go... We don't want to hurt those bottom pages. Oh, cut and pull. All right. Okay. There we go. All right. These are the tent flaps. Inside the tent flaps. So I'm thinking about constructing the back part first. The, the most inside. I'm doing the most inside pieces first. Okay, let's uh, strengthen this guy up. And this guy. This is dirty looking, but we're just going to tape right over it. It's not going to be an issue. Okay. It's a very tough tape, which is great. It's a good thing. It's just kind of very sticky, which we want. It'll be waterproof. won't lose its stickiness with water and construction I want it to last as long as forever because even you know with my last book I was still having to repair constructions with uh, the black masking tape so it's not good okay I'm so, 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 so
Uh oh. Ah, got it. And there was a lightning. Very, very frightening. Sorry, my head's in the way. It's gonna be the very inside guts, right? And then. Vision. Can I do that? Can I make that work? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Still thinking. This is going to have to be trimmed down. Um, thinking of the curtain and the curtain shape, right? I want to keep the bear for sure. All right, here's what I'm seeing in my brain, in case you guys are not um, following with me. I'm trying to construct a tent this. I don't know if this is gonna... and then here. The one, two, three. Then we have extra flaps in here. You'll see the curtains opening the doors. Okay, so to make this pop up, There you go. That's what's in my brain. I have to figure out how to make. Now I could do it. I could do it from here. A very tight, sharp one. But if you look at this tent, it's not as tall. It's more broad. So um, these are going to be the doors here, the tent innards. I don't want to mess up my bear. I think that'll be okay. I'm going to do one side first. I probably should have kept the full page, huh? Oh, I should have kept the full page. No. No, it's okay. This will be the doors of the tent. No. Hmm. Wow, did I mess up that bad? Okay. Alright, I'm just going to put these guys back on for now. 12 and 13. Okay. Alright, well, we're just going to see. Uh, you know, of course, this will get all covered. You know, this is just the basic construction I'm trying to figure out. I might take it off later because there is something that I'm thinking. I was I was doing that to keep the bulkiness down uh, because this page is now going to be incredibly bulky. And you'll see why. Of course, I just kind of showed you why. Okay. So if we put this guy back on here. And we put this guy back on here. I might take it off again. I don't know. 
I'm just uh, trying to figure out how to do the opening doors to the tent. That's what I'm working on. Opening doors. Okay. If it's not perfect, this is all gonna get covered. Covered, 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 covered. So I'm not worried about making it perfect right here. Sheer con. Tigers roar, filled the cave with thunder. construction up right here. Strengthen it. Strengthen it. Okay. Okay. The wolf cub is the man's cub is mine. He shall not be killed. He shall run. So this was originally going to be I didn't really necessarily need the tent that huge. That's what I'm thinking. I was like, oh my gosh, that's a huge tent. Um, we definitely want to make sure we've got these facing the right way. So that when we open, oh, see, we already have thickness issues. I might have to pull out one full signature back here. I don't know. We'll see gonna be even bigger oh that okay so we definitely need to cut these pages down we know that right so I'm going to cut here first in kind of this sweeping tent motion and I'm gonna take it over here and make the exact same shape or close to the same shape doesn't have to be exact but close is good Probably should have made those clothes. <laughs> she says as she cuts it off. It's alright. It'll be fine. All right. Get the one side to where you want it, and then let's uh, even them up. Alright. Okay, let's um, fortify that seam. It's gonna have a lot of open and closing. All right, and we're gonna fortify this seam here. Uh, 
All right. So in here, we will have the three rings. All right. This will be the opening pages. This will have the uh, posters on the front. How do I make a pop-up? I know how I make a pop-up. Here, I do it like that, but I wanna do it like that. I hate that I'm having to construct onto the, the front of the book. I don't like that. Okay, so this is pretty thick tape. And it doesn't really fold sharp. I think it'll be okay though. I just got thinking about the little flags that come off at the top of the tent.
I would like to make it how I'm envisioning it, but I don't know if I can. I should probably go um, on the computer and see if I can figure out how to do a pop-up. But, uh, I mean, there's the, there's the generic pop-up, you know, that you do this way. But we want to do a pop-up this way. And I don't know if that's something that I would find or not. Um, I'm going to go get on the internet. This is so not what I need to be doing right now. I need to really be working on other things. But, uh... I want to do it right. So basically, you end up building the tent yourself. And then once you get that open, then you see the inside of the tent. So this will all be part of the front of the tent. The sides of the tent. And you can walk into the world here. Uh, and as I put another layer of tape on there, that's going to make this side really, really thick. It will all get covered, though, and we do know that it is safe. So uh, let's just do that real quick. That I know I want to do. This is going to be kind of the main big construction page, I think, of the book. Of course, I've got to do the trapeze artists. Ooh, that'll be fun, right? That'd be cool. Alright. Uh... Okay. Okay, okay. Pretty sure that's how I want to do that, so we're just doing it. Which is cool. Here. something fun in here maybe a clown or oh, one of those twisty people snake lady okay these pages are not going to go anywhere by doing you know I'm, I'm making sure that that page isn't going to come off with continual folding and unfolding. However, it is adding a ton of thickness to the piece. Went all the way through it. Tearing it off. I did it the wrong way, guys. See, it went all the way through the piece of paper. Let's pull it off. It's not right. Let's pull it off. This is construction. This is just basic construction. It's it's hard. Don't ever let anybody tell you, oh, that's easy. Because it's not. If you want to make something cool, it's tough. Never an easy answer to anything. Of course, I have a tendency to take everything so far. But, uh, That's how you challenge yourself, right? Can't make it easy. Okay. So this is uh, what I messed up with on the first page. So basically, I want to be able to shut it. I want to be able to shut the book. All right. This will all get covered. not a clear dropping it's not oh gosh come on steppy take your time here do it right my hair is in my way it's gonna drive me crazy okay line it up with top and bottom push it in here a little bit now it is one thing about athletic tape it is definitely bulkier but that's perfection. Okay, so I'm not going to worry about doing the inside of this because uh, it will be covered with that paper. Okay, all right, good to know. 
This guy has to be done the same way. So we're going to make sure he's lined up. And put another layer of tape on the front of this book, which was not my intention. So guys, do this not on the very, very first page. I guess on the very first page, it would have been better to have... Ooh, it would have been cool to have the caravan coming into town. That would have been a cool image, right? That would have been great, having the train. Oh, you could have done the train on the first page. I'll still do it. No, I'll do it. I'll do it on the last page where they're leaving town. Okay, that one didn't work. Oh, my hair. I'm driving crazy. I got bangs in March. Or Jan uh, February. Not good plan. I've been trying to let them grow out ever since because unless you are willing to um, fix your bangs every single day, which I am not, I'd rather sit at my art table than do my hair in the morning. I go to work with my hair wet 95% of the time, but it ends up getting pulled up off the back of my head also. Most, most days. Which, you know, it makes me go, oh god, just cut your hair. Just cut your hair. And it's like, no, boys don't like it when you have short hair. And being six foot tall, I have a tendency to look a little masculine. Which doesn't do me any. But, you know, I get ma'am enough, or, you know, I get mistaken for a man from the back a lot because I have broad shoulders. from swimming when I was a kid, most likely, and riding motorcycles. Yeah, you can't. My street glide was um, almost 900 pounds without anything on it. And uh, you know, I, I lifted that thing all over the place. I, I want. How come that is so much shorter there? Here, than here to here. I did not compensate for the opening of the book. So this is a good half inch wider here. So we need a five and a half wide piece. Here we go right here. It's going sideways. Doesn't matter, it's gonna get covered, right? if when you opened up these pages opened up these pages if it caused it to pop up there oh, that would be so cool okay let's measure this to this <laughs> what am I doing? Oh my god. Why do I have to make everything so difficult? Alright, I need 
need for this to be able to bend. So I'm going to tape them together like this to start. Why am I doing it so hard? Stephanie, you don't have to make it so hard. Good God, girl. Okay. Hold this in here. Get lined up as exact as possible. Exact as possible. So this will allow it to bend fully because we're giving it all that space that it needs. Hopefully. Okay. Now we have a page. Gotta fold in that way. Okay. We have an extra fold up here. See, that's why I was wanting to go with the half pages uh, for the doors of the tent because of the extra bulk that this is giving. Hold on, let's do this first. Okay, it's got to tuck into there though. Okay, so this is forcing me to, I'm going to have to do this side. Which means I have to do that side. this page though and not with the front cover so it's lined up perfectly here okay. Okay, let's 
do this guy since I did that guy. And again, we want it to line up lush. And somehow I got a little bit off. Okay. So this we want to be able to fold in. This folds in. Here. Well, I still don't know. <laughs> okay. Okay. That's a lot of bulk right there. I understand that. Look what it's already doing. I can get this to work you know this is you know it is using the basics of the O'Keefe page but in a completely different way okay. so if we pull put pull tabs here and here and as that happens, can it make the top go up? Okay, so we need this to be able to pull in and flip up. Okay, um, so I want a nice pointy top. I can always cut that down, right? And I want to put a flag on it here both sides. Actually, let's make it a three. Pointed top. So I know it isn't mm, technically correct, right? Oh, but that's perfect. Right? I love that. Okay. Um, we're going to, of course, reinforce this inner side. Sorry if I keep pushing you out of focus. I hope to God you're recording. I'm going to check that. Oh my gosh. I have a feeling you're recording the wrong side. <laughs> 